Greetings YouTube, happy Friday and welcome to a day that I've been looking forward to ever since I duped and then eventually double duped my six star Hulkbuster and that is the new champion spotlight of the post beta test buffed Hulkbuster. Look at this fatty with some armor. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do we vote for him to get the buff? Because he was a meme. He was trash. He could only bust his own balls, nevertheless a Hulk. Alright, so, Hulkbuster's mechanics. Hulkbuster is a ramping damage and power control champion. Hulkbuster has received new mechanics based around breaking the opponent's block with unblockable special attacks to gain bonus effects on each special attack. He also brings new mechanics with slightly different abilities based on him being an attacker or defender. Gain more damage and aggressive power as an attacker and more health regeneration and tanky stats as a defender. Watch out for armor breaks though as they will strip him of a lot of his power. So uh, armor breaks, good way to uh, get him down. But tanky stats, when I see that, I think they want you to place that six-star duped Hulkbuster like I got on defense. And if he's a rank two or rank three six-star, make it hard to uh, not time out. Though thankfully in some of those tiers now, it'll be what, a five-minute timer instead of three minutes? All right. Six-star rank three level 45 will have 42,422 health, 3,169 attack, and 12,440 max sig pi. Strengths Power Control Hulkbuster has both Power Drain as well as Power Lock, giving him a ton of control over the opponent's power bar and making fights fairly safe. Master hitting the opponent's block with your Special 2 and your opponent's Special Attacks will be a worry of the past. Ramping Damage Hulkbuster continuously increases his attack based on how many shocks the opponent has active on them. Slide in your Heavy, unlike sliding into DMs, right? or special three to apply shocks to the opponent and watch your damage go sky high. Unblockable, all of Hulkbuster's special attacks will start with an unblockable buff being applied as soon as they begin. Use this to deal with auto block or pesky defensive opponents. Just make sure you watch out for it when you come across a wandering Hulkbuster. Weakness is armor break. If you break Hulkbuster's armor, then he will lose a lot of his defensive abilities. This is making me think of another, just another reason why Corvus is such a good champion. So make sure you're bringing in an armor break character to deal with him. Shock immunity. Hulkbuster relies on applying shocks to the opponent. Make sure you aren't taking him into a fight where he can't do that. So, while fighting as an attacker, either giant buster mode, granting the following up to 614 attack rating based on how large the opponent is. 860 attack rating increase for each shock effect on the opponent. So again, the special with special three and heavies. Developers note, stacking lots of Hulkbuster shocks on the opponent will result in some massive increases in the damage output. While fighting as a defender, enter Iron Wall mode, enhancing Hulkbuster's defensive abilities. Start a fight in every 15 seconds, you'll gain an indefinite armor up, granting 370 armor rating. This max stacks in Giant Buster 2 and max stacks in Iron Wall 4. Brought below 15% health once per fight, gain an indefinite armor up, granting 370 armor rating. If an Iron Wall, gain a second armor up buff. Fighting non-cosmic champions for each armor up buff, Hulkbuster gains the following benefits. 900 energy resistance, 87 critical damage rating. Incoming bleed and poison debuff suffer 25% less potency. Enemy attacks suffer 20% decrease in offensive ability accuracy. And enemy attacks suffer minus 137 critical damage rating. This stacks for each armor up buff on Hulkbuster. Try and see how many you can get on him. And then when struck by critical hits, 60% chance to consume one armor up buff to inflict a shock debuff, dealing 1,598 direct energy damage over 10 seconds. Yikes. So, I'm really curious, and I'm very thankful I don't have to actually test this out myself. For those of you in those new BS, we're going to cover that hopefully today on this channel, Alliance War nodes. Just how, uh, how much he's going to be a pain, especially as a 6-star Awakened Defender. Stack as many of these as you can in the attacker. Some massive damage via the bonus attack granted for each. Special attack, 100% chance to inflict an armor break debuff. 100% chance to gain an unblockable buff lasting one second. And then a rocketed shoulder tackle smashes the armored suit through whatever, whoever happens to be in front of the special one. 100% chance to stun for 1.5 seconds. If the opponent's block is broken by the attack, all of Hulkbuster's armor up buffs are consumed to add 
plus 1.25 second duration to the stun debuff for each armor up consumed this way. Developers note, getting the massive stun from breaking an opponent's block with this attack gives you a great chance to throw in lots of heavy attacks and stack on the shocks. So if they're stunned, immediately fire off the heavy. An uppercut stuns the enemy, setting them up for a powerful repulsor ray blast on the special two. And if the opponent's block is broken by this attack, all beam attacks have a 100% chance to inflict power burn. This is why waiting to hit their block on that special two is so important. And then special three, the ultimate and Hulk busting technology. That sounds like an internet phrase. Showcasing exactly what it can do. The attack drains 50% of the opponent's current power and flicks up to three shock debuffs. Unblockable buffs triggered during this attack gain plus 4.5 seconds duration. Wow. And then the signature ability and upgrade to the Veronica protocol allows Hulk Buster to activate a self repair when his health runs low. Brought below 15% health once per fight, 100% chance to activate a self repair buff lasting 12 seconds and recovering 14,814 health. This buff is lost if Hulkbuster is stunned. So that makes you think of somebody like Ultron, right? And then the synergy bonuses with Yellow Jacket and uh, and also Hulk, Hulk Ragnarok, Mr. Fantastic, Black Panther, Black Panther Civil War. So we might have to experiment on these when we can. Enemies with Ultron, Cold Obsidian, and uh, Critical Rating, Health. Recommend Master's Despair. Hulkbuster stacks a ton of debuffs on the opponent, bringing in Despair is going to help you control the opponent's regeneration, recovery, coagulate, etc. Okay, well, let's throw this on YouTube and get excited to test this out uh, soon. I'm very uh, thrilled that Hulkbuster was buffed. Definitely gives my six-star roster another exciting addition to the team. Thanks for watching, YouTube. Let me know your thoughts on the buffs below. Have a good one.